10 things I wish I would have told my past self. I got asked this question the other day and it really kind of threw me because I know I thought about these things, but I just thought, you know, I'm going to sit down and write them all down. What I would have told myself when I started this journey in entrepreneurship. Hey, I'm Mark Nelson, a former teacher turned lifestyle entrepreneur and a business coach or consultant. So enjoy my journey. So these are the 10 things that I've told my past self. The first one is believe in myself or believe in yourself if you're listening to this. Because what happens is starting any new venture, there's ups and downs and you just have to kind of believe you're gonna do it. And if you don't believe in yourself, things are just gonna fall apart on you. So number first thing I would do is believe in myself. Just know I'm going to do it. Number two was make a decision. Seriously. I'm the Libra. Born in October. So I have a hard time making decisions. But whatever you're going to do, make a decision. I'm a risk taker at the same time. But there's things that I've looked at and I just kind of hesitated. But just make a decision. That's all. Yes or no. It's either going to be the right decision or the wrong decision. But make a decision then to analyze what you got going. Three is you got to surround yourself with the right people who are going to encourage you but also hold you accountable. I mean, I'm not going to be a naysayer. This is a journey. And you got to have people telling you that, hey, you know, you can do this. But you said you were going to do this last week. So you got to surround yourself with some people who are going to help you out on your journey. And this is the old Nike one. Number four, just do it. If you are thinking of starting a business, just do it. You're never going to have all the answers. I never had all the answers. Just do it. Man, I have been in three or four different things. I've been in different niches and I would just try to go, I'd find my way. I'd start learning on the way and as I get better and better, I thought, no, this is the avenue I need to be. The fifth one, I think that's, it's know where you're going. What do you call it, a vision? Where are you headed in this journey? One year, five years, what are your goals? Because that's what's going to take you on your way all the way through. So know where you're going. The sixth one is take care of yourself. Right? Health-wise, eating-wise, hydrating-wise, the right food. Take care of yourself. I read self-development books all the time. I listen to things because I need my mental game to be on point and you do too the next one which is seven i believe is family sometimes it's so easy to put on the blinders and just go that you forget your family's involved with it and believe me my first journey my wife had to tell me why we had kids and I went on a different journey after that because it's like, I forgot. I was so in tune on what I was doing that I really kind of spaced out, left my family alone. The eighth one is watch limiting beliefs. I mean, they're there all the time. And I don't care how long you've been in this game. You're, they're always there. I'm not good enough. I'm not smart enough. Who the heck said I'm going to do this? I want to be a seven-figure business earner. Who said you could do that? What? You're coaching an eight-figure business? What? How can you do that? You can do it. Watch the limiting beliefs. The ninth one is consistency. I know you've seen these people and gurus will tell you you got to work your tail off to make a lot of money. So just be consistent. And I go against that. Let's say you work 40 hours in a week to make $100,000. Then you want to make a million dollars. Does that mean you got to work 400 hours a week? If you want to make 10 million, that makes you got to work 4,000 hours a week? No. You just got to get a game plan. You got to be consistent. 
and do something every day to grow your business. Just be consistent. And the 10th one is never give up. Now you can switch, learn, make mistakes. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. This works. Never give up. So let me go over those again. I hope you enjoyed those. One was believe in yourself. Make a decision today. Surround yourself with people who are going to encourage you and hold you accountable. Just do it. Know where you're going. Take care of yourself, your family. Watch Limited Beliefs, consistency, and never give up. And I'm talking like I'm talking to you. That's what I wish I would have told my past self. Hey, if you're watching this on YouTube, Hit the subscribe button, notifications, leave a comment. I read all the comments. I'm going to answer them all. Tell me what you think about this. What things do you wish you would have told yourself? If you're listening to the podcast, go to your favorite podcast. Where you're listening, give me a review. Five star. <laughs> but also, leave the reviews. I read them. I'll reach out to you. Hey, we're going to talk again soon. You take care. Believe in yourself. And keep on going.